Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to make some binder covers. So the materials I'll be using throughout this video is mostly going to be paint. So I do want to warn you that paint can usually get pretty messy. So if you'd like, you can use other art supplies of your own. So for this first binder cover, I'm going to be using two paint colors that mix pretty well together. And I'm just going to create horizontal lines of different thicknesses and different amounts of paint. And I'm doing that with my first color. And then with my second color, I'm just going to repeat that same process and fill in the white space. And I'm also trying to blend it a little to give it a more aesthetic feel. And once it has completely dried, I'm going to create a, or I'm going to write the subject name using calligraphy, but you can use any type of font you would like. And then to spice it up even more, I'm going to be using glitter to make it even more aesthetic and to really get the title to stand out. And here's the final product. Okay, so now we're going to move on to the second binder cover. So I'm going to start by writing the subject name and I am using calligraphy again, but you can use whatever type of font you would like. And I am going to take a color of my choice. I'm using this really pretty gold color and I am just going to border the subject title. And then I am going to be using a gold pen to further, I guess, border the border, just to make it really crisp and just more aesthetic. And then I am going to be using some washi tape to just kind of border the title again. And for the bottom part, I would recommend using masking tape because we're gonna apply some paint um, and again, I would use masking tape to create this triangular shape because what we were what we're going to be doing is we're going to be painting the different sections with colors of our choice and I'm using paint colors that are going to match the gold color and the washi tape. So I'll be using this pretty green color, this blue, and I'm going to be mixing it with white to really give a light and pastel color. And I'm going to be using this very thick paintbrush because we don't want to take a bunch of time. And I'm just going to start painting it. So once we finish painting, I'm just going to peel the washi tape off. And then I'll be replacing it with a brand new piece of washi tape and I'll color the white space with the same gold marker. And for the final binder cover, I am going to be using two paint colors that blend very well together. And I'm just going to be creating a swirl pattern with the first paint color. And then I'm going to make sure to leave space between the swirl so that I can fill it in with the second color. And I am taking my paintbrush and making the swirl and making sure to blend it a little bit to create an aesthetic look and make sure not to use too much paint because 
in the end you'll get a really weird and rough texture which you do not want. And then I created this header on a flashcard and I'm just going to glue it to the cover. And that's it for this video. I hope I gave you inspiration to make binder covers of your own. And thank you so much for watching this video. Bye!